private psychiatric hospitals admit a really broad range of people. They range from adolescents through adults through elderly people with a whole range of mental health problems. Common problems like depression, anxiety, drug and alcohol problems, even less common things like schizophrenia. One of the reasons people come into hospital is things like suicidal ideas where there's a real risk and danger. And clearly in hospital we can observe people and support them during those difficult times. The treatment a person gets is tailored to what they need and will usually involve a close discussion between them and their psychiatrist. Almost all patients will be involved in therapy, both group and individual. There'll be other group activities involving things like art therapy, yoga or exercise, all of which we know can be beneficial to the treatment of mental health problems. There's also some treatments like ECT that we utilise for some of the most serious conditions. They'll also have lots of opportunity to have one-on-one -on -one discussions with their nurse. In hospital, you usually be greeted at a reception desk. They'll help you get to the ward and find your way around. And usually their nurse will greet you, take some admission details and show you around the place so you know where to go for various things. Your psychiatrist is responsible for leading your care. That means your psychiatrist will meet with you most days, review how things are going and what you need to work on next. Your psychiatrist will also meet regularly with the rest of the team. That means nurses, psychologists, occupational therapists, or whoever else in the hospital is there to help you. The average length of stay in a psychiatric hospital now is about two to three weeks. Many people worry about what's it going to be like with the other people in hospital. For many people, having a mental health problem can be quite isolating. Remember that these people are more likely to understand what it's like than most people you meet every day. People get better in hospital. They usually need ongoing support afterwards and your psychiatrist is likely to continue to be part of that care team.